morning everybody welcome back to the vlog today's video is going to be a pack and prep video we're getting ready to go on a little road trip and i wanted to bring you guys along our day um at the moment we are headed to go get our rental car because we decided to not drive one of our cars let's go through our secret cave Picked up the rental car, um, and then we decided to go get something to eat. We drove to Pooler to get something to eat. There's this new Jamaican, or not new, it's new to me. This Jamaican spot that I wanted to check out for a while. Um, it has great reviews. Um, so it is called Mo Mobe Island Cuisine. I got the brown stew chicken with white rice and mac and cheese. So Kenny got his food now. Let's see. Ooh, yummy. Looks really good. Brown stew chicken, mac and cheese, and white rice. And this guy went to the Chinese place next door. <laughs> Ooh, chicken wings and the rice. It's regular chicken wings? Yeah. Yummy. Okay. And a sweet tea. Is that sweet tea? Yeah. Yeah. And a great, great fanta. Okay. All right. So we're back home. I'm trying to figure out what I want to wear. I feel like I have nothing to wear and I should have gone shopping because when we moved, I got rid of a lot of things, especially for the summertime. We moved in the winter. And I think in my mind, I was like, I'm going to get some new things once it gets warmer. Well, it's warmer now. And I feel like I don't have anything to wear. So let's see. So we're going to be gone for like four days. And I'm definitely not going to be bringing any of these because it's pointless to bring any winter clothes. I'm the type of gal that I leave all my clothes up. Um, I'll, I may switch them to a different closet, like really big jackets like this. But I will usually just leave them in the closet. I don't really care. It doesn't bother me. I can tell my husband put that up. Let me move that. Um, I really love these, so I may bring this and then the jeans that I'm wearing right now, I'll probably bring, um, or maybe I'll just bring, them. actually, I, I like, I'll bring the jeans that I brought, or that I have on, they're comfy and pretty loose, so I'll bring those, scratch that because I don't want them too much. Probably 
Probably it's not gonna be put up, but okay. Y'all, I'm so tired. I just got done with a test. And oh my gosh, my brain is fried. But I've got to finish packing um the toiletry bag. Um, I don't need this because I already have one. I know the spiel on my toiletry bag. I like to pack um, me and Kenny's stuff in here. Um, it's just easy. I got it off of Amazon a few years ago. Um, it's linked in my Amazon storefront, but this travel bag is so convenient. It's literally gone with me across the world, literally. Um, but it's just nice that it just hangs like this and um, it's it fits a lot of things. Um, so. And then I just will literally just attach this part to my backpack and it's good to go. Um, but yeah, so this and my husband's stuff will fit in here. Um, I've got hair products in this little thing. And then also a hack if you have like liquids and stuff, whether you're on a plane or on a road trip, like we're, we're about to do, um, put it in a Ziploc bag because I've had instances where, my stuff leaked out on everything and that's no fun. So anything with liquid, just get like a cute little small Ziploc bag and does the trick. Um, another little hack I did for Armand jewelry, you can get something smaller, but I just found this at Goodwill and um, I just put all my jewelry in this and it's just nice to keep it organized. It's not all over the place. And then also my jewelry doesn't get um, tangled. So nice little, little thing. Um, if you're traveling on a plane, I would always recommend keeping your jewelry um, that means a lot to you and that you don't want to get lost or stolen or whatever. Keep it on your person. I always put my jewelry in my backpack that I take on the plane. I never ever check it in because you just never know. My aunt has had an instance where her bags have been rummaged through and I don't ever want that to happen. So um, yeah. But this has a lot of different compartments and whatnot. Toothbrush, toothpaste, everything fits in here. Like a glove. Um, I think that's all I'm gonna bring. And then I just take all of my big stuff like this. I didn't wanna bring this obviously, so I just poured it in there. Um, I think that's it for the toiletry bag. And then this is my makeup bag. Um, I'm still trying to, to like downsize this, but it really isn't. It looks like a lot, but it really isn't. All my skincare um, will go in here. Moisturizers, which I actually will usually just refill this um, with any moisturizer. It's smaller, so. But right now, my skin's been acting crazy, so I have like a slew of things that I use um, at the moment. Um, so let me see if I can actually downsize a few of these things this is my perfume i'm gonna bring this is a shower cap um, cleanser i will usually use a some sort of like gentle cleanser and then an acne foaming cleanser um or acne cleanser with salicylic acid in it following i started double cleansing and i feel like that's just changed my skin um we're gonna be outside a lot so i'm gonna bring some spf and I don't need two of these. I don't know why I have two. So I'll leave this. An oil for my face to keep it hydrated. Um, and then I'm gonna take these salicylic acid pads and put them like in a smaller container so I don't have to lug this big thing around, which 